Africa is endowed with minerals, although African countries need capacity to locate and exploit these minerals. There is a training as part of the European-funded effort to help Africa generate skills in the mineral sector. Minister for Karmoja Affairs, also former State Minister for Minerals, urged participants to commit to a culture of innovation and networking. And this is an organization of all geologists in Africa. It is very nice indeed to share knowledge as Africans and bring the Africans together in many areas. In the future, it strengthens the geopolitical uh, stay of Africans. Part of the wider training aimed at doing practical on the field is collecting data, share experiences to broaden career opportunities. So, the training will increase investment in the mineral sector to enhance capacity of the Department of Geological Mines and Surveys. Participants have varied into the intricate world of just geoscientific mapping, from mastering the fundamentals to navigating advanced techniques. This training session is also about fostering meaningful connections and partnerships. The Permanent Secretary, Minister of Energy and Mineral Development Engineer Irene Bateve says, since Africa is experiencing rush of foreign investors in the mineral sector, there is need to develop manpower that will develop the resources. We are at a point where the global world is discussing aspects of the energy transition. And it's very critical that us, who are the planners, who are the geoscientists, are playing our roles to support our governments to be able to quantify these resources and therefore be able to develop them. The government of Uganda wants all minerals to be processed for value addition before export. So this training attracted participants from Uganda, Tanzania, Rwanda, Eritrea, Ethiopia, Sudan, Zambia, Angola, Malawi, Botswana, Mozambique and Egypt. Aviana Francisco, UBC.